Young lady, you need to hurry up and get your butt to school now. I do not have all day. You gotta get to walking, and I have to get to work. Come on. I'm literally already dressed. Like, do you have to yell? Goodness, mom. I just need to brush my teeth, and then I'm ready to go. She is so, so annoying. I swear. I can never have a moment just to myself. Besides, why can I never have a moment just to myself without anyone yelling at me? Oh, hey. Hey, what are you doing here? It's nice to see you again. It's been quite a while. Uh, <laughs> hey, you know, I have to go to school soon, and, you know, your daughter goes to the same school as me, so I was just wondering if you'd want me to walk her to school just to make sure that she's safe and all, you know? Since we're besties and we look out for each other. Well, that's actually so sweet. Yes, I'll hurry up and get her right now because she's taking all day. You stay right here, young man. You're so wonderful. Um, hello? Open up this bathroom. Move it, move it. You need to get out now. The name neighbor is going to walk you to school because he said you guys are besties how fun is that what did you just say no he cannot walk me to school please tell me you didn't say yes um i already told you i do not like the neighbor he's weird oh yeah well is he weird even though he's helping you get to school huh i don't think so that's not weird that's just really nice and neighborly Ugh. you have got to stop trying to meddle in my business okay i can pick who i do or don't want to be friends with i don't need your help mom i got this and besides you've picked a terrible person to help me out. Terrible schmerable. Go with him now to school. He's a nice, strong looking young man and he'll protect you. Okay, I gotta get to work, so hurry up. Ugh, I hate when she does that to me. This is gonna be the most awkward walk to school of my life. Thanks a lot, mom. Okay, you two. Have a wonderful day at school and maybe if you're free, you can walk her back home at night to keep her safe, you know? Oh yeah, miss, I would have no problem with that at all. Trust me, I got my besties back. I'm not your bestie, you creep. And stop telling my mom that we're friends. We are not! So, shall we get uh, moving? Listen, dude, you'll be able to fool my mom, but you're not fooling me. There is no we, and I will be going by myself, thank you. I walk to school by myself every day. Nothing's gonna change today. Uh, but I'm afraid I can't let you go alone because I told your mom I would look out for you and watch over you and keep you safe. And, uh, that's exactly what I'm gonna do. So, come on, bestie, we don't want to be late. I have perfect attendance. Oh, great. What a terrible way to start my day. I mean, are you kidding me, dude? Anybody but this guy, please. Hey, you see, because of me, you made it all nice and safe, huh? Isn't that wonderful? Maybe you could repay me with a kiss, maybe? Yeah, not happening, buddy. I didn't ask you to go with me, okay? You asked to go with me because you won't leave me alone. I don't know how many times I have to tell you that I'm not interested, but I'm not interested, okay? So get over yourself and go away. Do not talk to me for the entire rest of the day. I've had enough of you. Ah, uh, you don't mean that. Come on, I'll sit with you and we can eat breakfast together. Huh? Doesn't that sound good? I'll buy it for you. I don't need you to buy my breakfast. I have my own money. It's right. Wait, uh, where's my wallet? Dang it, no! You made me forget my wallet! Oh, don't worry, bruh. I'll make sure you have breakfast, baby. <laughs> I mean, that's what boyfriends are for, right? Come on. Boyfriend? Ugh, you're not my boyfriend, so stop acting like that. I already told you no. But you can buy me breakfast because I'm hungry. So what do you think, huh? You should be very happy right now, you know? Happy for what? It's just breakfast. Don't get ahead of yourself. No, it's oatmeal. I know that's your favorite. Your mom makes it for you every morning. How did you know that? I never said anything about my mom doing that before. Uh, well, you totally you told me that before, for sure, yeah. You definitely did. I definitely did not. You know what? I'll just eat when I get home. You can have this oatmeal. Wait, baby, no, please. Ugh, and don't call me baby. I'm going to class. Eat breakfast by yourself and literally do not talk to me anymore. We're not friends and I don't want to be. I see enough of you at 
home. Wow, class, I'm very proud of you all. These are really good grades I'm seeing here. <sighs> I'm a wonderful teacher, aren't I? Uh, yeah, totally, miss. But if you don't mind, can I please go to the bathroom? I've been holding it for a long time. Um, all right, but class is almost over, so try to hurry back. I need to be the one to dismiss you. Thanks a lot. I'll try to make it as quick as I can. Be right back, miss. I gotta get to the bathroom fast. I don't want to miss dismissal. Oh, I gotta hurry, I gotta hurry. Oh, I need to use the bathroom really bad. Ah, oh, finally, I made it. Ah, oh, nice and quick and easy. Ooh, hey, I didn't expect to see you here. Ah, oh, this is a pleasant surprise. Oh, absolutely not. What are you doing in here? I am so... So, gonna report you to the principal. I'm getting you kicked out of my school. Why are you even in here? You're watching me use the bathroom, huh? You're such a freak, and I am sick and tired of it. Not only am I gonna report you to the principal for this, but I'm also going to get you kicked out of the neighborhood, so you have to live anywhere else but by me. Finally. I've got you caught for the creep that you are. Uh, dude, I'm not the one in the wrong bathroom here. If anything, I should be reporting you. Oh yeah, you're gonna report me for being in the girls' bathroom? I don't think so, but guess what? I can get you in trouble this time. Yeah, after all of these months of you bothering me, you're going down. Creep, finally! Yeah, you might want to come look at this. Look at what? What is he talking about? There's nothing for me to look at. I want to look at you behind bars, buddy. Uh, wait, what? No way. This is the boys' bathroom? It's not what it looks like. I was only here because I was rushing because my teacher told me to hurry up and come back. And, you know, yeah, it was a mistake. Forget all that stuff I said, okay? Misunderstanding, right? We're cool? Oh, yeah, babe. We're totally cool. Uh, but, I mean, you did just threaten to report me and get me kicked out of the neighborhood. Maybe I should do the same. Since you're the one in the wrong bathroom this time, you look like the creep. And I think I might be feeling scared of you right now. What? No, you can't do that. Look, okay, it was a mistake. I just was rushing and I didn't notice the sign. That That's all. But you can't report me. Because I'm not the actual creep here. You are. You're the one in the boys' bathroom. I don't know. Fine. Do whatever you want. I don't care. It's not like I'm really the bad guy here. Everyone knows that you're the freaky one. Okay. I guess I'll just go tell the principal on you now. Um. Yeah, have fun. Wait. No, please. Okay, listen, 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 let's just make a deal, all right? I won't snitch on you the next time you do something weird, but just don't get me in trouble right now. I didn't know it was the boys' bathroom, okay? It was an honest mistake. Trust me, there's no way I would ever want to watch you use the bathroom. Fine, but I'm only going to do that under one condition, and you have to agree or I'm getting you expelled. One condition? What? You have to... Go on a date with me. Just one. Nothing too crazy, but I get to pick how it goes. And you have to say yes, or you're going to get in trouble big time. Uh, yeah, not happening, buddy. You're just going to have to get me expelled. I don't want to go on a date with you. Pick something else. Nope, that's what I want. I want a date. Just a one-time thing, just to get you to realize that you actually like me. Ugh, you're disgusting. Are you trying to blackmail me? Huh? Is that your game here? Ahem. So, you didn't have to use the bathroom room at all did you you just came out here to chit chat and who is this your little boyfriend uh actually ma'am yes it is i'm her boyfriend we were just talking about a date we were gonna go on but uh i didn't mean to get her in trouble this is all my fault uh, wait what, what, what boyfriend whoa i see i see well, you are a really good student, you have good grades and all, but next time I let you use the bathroom, you do just that, all right? And why are you standing outside the boys' bathroom? What's going on? Uh, again, ma'am, all me, not her. <sighs> so, babe, it looks like I'll be seeing you later for our date. But, what, what, 
Um, all right, all right. You two can flirt with each other later after school. You get back to my classroom right now, young lady. The school day is not over just yet. We still have a few more minutes. Let's go. What the heck is wrong with you? Why? Why, why would you say that? Uh, 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 don't be mad. I just saved your butt. I saved your butt twice in a row now, actually. So you owe me this date now. No backing out. Anyways, I gotta finish using the bathroom. I never washed my hands. See you later, baby. Oh, so gross. I think I could just vomit right now. But there's no time for puking. I gotta get back to class. Finally, school is over. I need to get home without him seeing me. Because there is no way in any universe that I'm going on a date with him. He's been stalking me for the longest, and I just can't believe it. Oh, uh-oh. He's waiting for me on the bench. I'm just gonna quietly go the opposite way home, even though this is gonna take quite a while. I cannot let him see me. I'll crawl through these bushes if I have to. All right, I need to run. I can't let him walk me home because he's gonna try to force me to go on the date. But haha, -ha, at least I didn't get snitched on. Oh my gosh, it's getting dark out now, but finally I've made it home. Oh, my poor feet. But it was so worth it to not run into that creep trying to force a date on me. Hey mom, I'm home. What are you doing? Oh, it's about time you get back here. I'm washing dishes. So what took you so long to get home, huh? You were supposed to walk home with the neighbor. And now I was sitting here worried sick about you. I thought maybe you were kidnapped or something. Goodness, mom, why do you always have to go to the extremes? I was not kidnapped. I am right here. I just took the longer route, okay? And I told you, that dude is not my friend. And I don't want anything to do with him, let alone be forced to walk home with him. Anyways, what are we having for dinner? I'm starving. That walk took all of my energy. Oh, right. Uh, well, I heard that you already have plans for dinner, so I didn't cook anything. Huh? Since when did I have plans for dinner? I never said that. Uh, yeah, I know you never said that, but... But I did. You ready to go, baby? Car's right outside. What the? Mom, what is he doing here? Oh, don't act so rude. He told me you guys are dating now and you're going on your first date tonight. And that's just so cute, my little baby. Oh, you're all grown up. I can't believe it, but I knew you two were well suited for each other. I mean, look at you two. Two people. In the pod. Uh, she just gets us, right, babe? What the? Mom, how could you? How could I what? I am not. Uh, 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 come on, I kept your secret. Now, the car is outside. We need to go. Oh, my baby. He's all grown up. I hope you have a wonderful time on your very, very first date. Oh, so exciting. I will never forgive you for this, Mom. Huh? What are you talking about? <sighs> Nothing. I'll be back. And please, if I'm not back in one hour, call the police. That means something happened to me. All right, all right. Now just go. Enjoy, you two lovebirds. Ugh, that's the grossest thing I've ever heard. All right, dude. So where's your rinky-dinky car? Across the street at my house. Come on, girlfriend. <laughs> what a weirdo. Well, don't get too ahead of yourself, okay? I'm being forced to do this right now where we're only doing this because i don't want my secret told but since this is a one-time thing you better not ever blackmail me like this again you got that or i will hurt you yeah yeah babe i got it all right hop in i'm gonna take you somewhere very special fine but if i'm not back home in an hour my mom is gonna call the police on you haha -ha, very funny come on wait a second this is your car how can you afford something like this isn't this car like two hundred and fifty thousand dollars yeah well you gotta make money when you live on your own okay i'm sure your parents must have i don't know got this for you <gasps> no you stole it sure sure i did just come on where are we going anyways i don't like surprises relax you'll like this one all right girlfriend right this way not your girlfriend just also not trying to get in trouble here you are blackmailing me so calm down this is a lot of food for just the two of us don't you think <laughs> nothing's ever too much for you my beautiful beautiful girlfriend oh dude seriously i mean what is wrong with you 
I'm not your girlfriend, okay? You do realize that you blackmailed me into this date? Do you really think that I've just magically fallen in love with you? Uh, I think you could give it a shot. If you really try to get to know me, you'll see. I'm not a bad guy. I just don't take no for an answer. Yeah, not taking no for an answer is a creepy thing to do. Don't you get that? You literally scare me. Oh, there's nothing to be scared of. I would never hurt you. So let me ask you something. Since I have to be here with you for the next hour, why will you not leave me alone? Huh? I mean, seriously, is there no other girls that you can bother? Someone at school or maybe somebody else in the neighborhood who's not me? Huh, where's the fun in that? I don't think there's anyone better than you. So I'm only going to bother you. And is it really bothering you if you kind of have a big crush on me? I don't think so. Uh, who said I have a crush on you? I do not. Again, you're being delusional. Oh, yeah. If you don't have a crush on me, then why are we on a date? Huh? Uh, what? Because you forced me to be here, remember? Or you were gonna get me expelled? Oh, come on, I wasn't actually gonna do that. It was just a joke. Man, you really think I would do something like that to you? I'm not that cruel. I mean, you are, but I'm not. Look, you're just really smart and really pretty and very funny. So, I'm interested. I've never been turned down as much as I've been turned down by you. Eh, maybe you should take it as a sign that maybe I don't want you. You know, is it clicking yet? Ah, uh, whatever. Are you really gonna sit here and say that you're not having a good time with me? Well, the food is good. I can admit that part. But other than that, ah, uh, nah. You see, girls usually like it when they go on dates with guys they actually like. Oh, yeah? Tell me, what kind of guy do you like? Well, I like buff guys. Uh, I like rich guys. I like guys that know how to take no for an answer, which is a skill you clearly have not mastered yet. So you are far from my type. Um, and I like a guy who is very sweet and kind. Again, far from you. You know what's crazy? I'm all of those things. Yeah, I'm super buff and I'm super flirty and nice. Uh oh, whoa, buddy. I said rich too, and that's not you. <laughs> Please, I'm so rich, you wouldn't even believe it. Uh, yeah, you're right. I don't believe it, and I won't believe it. How come? You see my car. You know it's expensive. I know that you stole it! Yeah, a creep like you would steal a car. Uh-huh. Oh, come on. I didn't steal the car. You really don't think I'm rich? I really don't. You live right across the street from me, so you can't be that rich. Uh, what? Come on. That's just a summer home. I can show you where I usually live. No thanks, I just want to eat my soup and get this hour over with. Oh, please, okay, look, the deal was I get to choose the date. So now I'm gonna prove to you how rich I am on top of all of my other good qualities and then you're going to surely love me forever. <laughs> yeah, right, you can try. I'm kind of getting tired of the soup anyways. Go on, prove it, all right. Let's go then. Go? Go where? I don't want to go anywhere. You can't just prove it by like showing me your bank account or something. That would be way easier. Just come on or I'm leaving you here with no way home. Uh, rude. You can't do that. I'm coming. Hold on, dude. Gosh, so bossy. All right. Miss non-believer, it's time for me to show you that I am rich. And we're here. Hop on out. Let's go. Don't make me wait all night. I will leave you here. Ta-da! What do you think? This shows I'm pretty rich, doesn't it? Now you have no choice but to fall madly in love with me. I meet all your requirements. Uh, you want me to be impressed over this dingy little boat? That doesn't prove a thing, buddy. No, not that. This boat, the one behind you. You know, the giant yacht. Huh? What the? This is yours? No way, you're lying. If this is yours, then prove it right now. Tuh, fine, hop on. What? No way. Dude, what are you doing? You cannot just walk onto random people's boats. Hilarious. Oh yeah, we'll watch this. You better come on. <gasps> you're crazy. We're gonna get arrested. So now do you believe me, huh? This ought to prove it. Aren't you in love with me yet because I'm handsome and rich? Uh, I believe that we're going to get arrested and sent to jail if we don't get off of these random people's boats. What do you think you're doing? We gotta go. Girl, chillax. This is my boat. Okay, look, I'll even drive it for you. 
Check it out. We're moving. What? Oh my gosh. Wait, you're actually driving this yacht? Oh, we're going to jail. We're definitely going to jail. You should probably take a seat. It's going to be a little rocky. I'm sitting. I'm sitting. Oh my gosh. This really better be your boat or we're in big trouble. Whoa, whoa. Do you even know how to drive this thing? Why are you swerving? Be careful. We're in the ocean. There's sharks. See, it's my yacht. Now, we're fine, but tell me, could I really, really have driven this yacht if it wasn't mine? And could I have a yacht if I wasn't mega rich? Okay, well, I'm starting to believe you, kind of, but why did I never know this before? Uh, because you never talked to me before and gave me the chance to explain myself. We never got to get to know each other. Well, you also kind of were doing creepy, weird stuff to me, like stalking me and literally being obsessed. That's scary, dude. All right, all right. That's my fault. So how about we start over, huh? Let's go to the deck. Uh, it's raining really hard, though, and we're in the ocean. I don't think that's a good idea. I don't know. I think the rain's easing up. What the? It stopped. Yep. That's a sign that me and you need to go have a romantic little talk on the deck. Go. Wait, don't leave me here. What are you talking about? Where do I go? Chill, girl. Up the ladder. Up here. Okay, hold your horses. Wait for me. Whoa. This is really cool. Whoa, I've never been in the ocean, especially not at night. It's so beautiful. Yeah, the view is amazing. Uh, you're not even looking at it. I'm looking at something whole lot more beautiful you know all this flirting you're doing is really starting to freak me out it's unnatural you know uh, how is it unnatural you're my girlfriend i mean we're literally on a date and you're on my yacht does it get any better than this huh hmm i guess this is cool it's more than cool it's perfect Ah, <sighs> finally. After all this chasing, you're mine. Look, how about we just sit down and we enjoy the view? I won't say anything else weird, unless you want me to. Alright, fine. This, I can look at all night. You know what? It's, you know what? It's been four hours. My baby's missing. I'm gonna call the police. She won't answer her phone. Oh my gosh, I should have never made her go on that date. She's in danger. Hello, 911? My daughter has been kidnapped by our neighbor. Find her, please.